Hi guys, this is DC Game Clips One, and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to uh, create or change a um, start button. So you can have your start, sort of custom one, but you have to download them. So first, I want you to go into the start menu, hover over computer, right click, go to properties. If you want me to do that again, you just computer, right click go down to properties and then it'll bring you to this we need to go up to here to system protection and then it will bring a window up saying system properties and then system protection there then I want you to go to click the Acer C drive uh, if your laptop's not Acer then it could be Vista C drive or HP C drive make sure it's that C drive there Okay, then go to create. So it creates a restore point right now for the drives that have system protection turned on. So if anything goes wrong, then it will, once you do the system restore, it will get, take you back to before you did the start point change. So I'm not saying it will go wrong, but it's just in case, you know. And I'm just going to call it Windows 7 Start Button Change two because I've already done one as you can see there it's the Apple logo and then I'm going to create that <coughs> and then uh, you have to wait till it says creating a restore point um, it shouldn't take too long given that if you have a fast laptop which mine is arguably quite fast because it's the uh, Acer Core i5 processor so here we go didn't take too long so then you just click close click the cross on these two and then uh, open up your internet browser and then get, we're going to go to a website called Deviant Art and then um, this is where you can download you can download themes uh, and loads of all sorts of stuff so basically you need to look for a, a download which either has something like that or like that so where it's got three start buttons uh, like that or there you can see there's three on each row like that so I'm gonna go with biohazard orbs because this looks quite cool and all the links will be in the description and you'll need WinRAR for this because it's a RAR file okay so that's downloaded and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight these two because they're bitmap in images and I'm just gonna put them into my Windows 7 mods on my well I'll put them onto my desktop first look and show you guys and then I'm just gonna pop them into my folder so that they, they're not just like cluttering up space on my desktop and I'm gonna put it into Windows 7 mods go into Windows 7 mods and then put them into Windows 7 start um, Windows 7 start buttons, but I've already done that bit, but I'll just move and replace and move and replace. Okay, then you want to go on to Windows 7 Start Orb Changer, which you need to download. And obviously, there's WinRAR, but yeah, it, I find things easy with WinRAR, so that's how it is now. If uh, so, if you go to change and then you click that, wait, you click that one original, <coughs> you just click it. And then that's how you do it. And then it'll load, and uh, once you selected it, it'll change like that. And then it'll come up with success. The start orb has been changed successfully. But if it doesn't work, and you don't have anything, you can't see anything on your on your screen, like all your icons or this, the bar. If it's just your wallpaper, then just turn the power off and turn turn your laptop back on or PC just press it with the button that you use to turn your laptop on or PC and then just start Windows normally and that will put it back uh, that will get you all your stuff back if that happens and then restore means it will uh, just change it back to the normal one so uh, I'm gonna put it as this one because show you guys this one this one's quite cool it's a door literally to windows 7 or which is really 
nice and neat, which is quite cool. Or I'll, <coughs> I'll uh, put it as the Apple logo. Just show you how guys how easy it is, which is really good. Plus, this program is free. All the downloads is free as well. Um, so yeah, all the links will be in the description, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. <coughs> And um, be sure to check out my next videos. I'll be doing more mods, uh, and I'll be showing you how to get uh, like six desktops. Like this is your desktop. But I know how to get six, so please stay tuned for that. There'll probably be a link in an annotation right up here. So thanks, guys, for watching, and uh, uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.